Okay, so let's um, let's just touch on some very basic Docker commands. Um, so I I, um, I ran the Docker Ubuntu container. Um, so this is just Docker list command, um, and it lists all the uh, containers that you've been using. And uh, so we ran the Ubuntu container and we exited it immediately. And then we have another one here where we ran the Ubuntu container and we ran it in the background and it's still up and running. So let's first, um, let's remove this container. So the, the way Docker works is when you start running containers is it logs a history of all your uh, actions. And you know, what I could do is I could um, I could do things with this container with this ID. I could um, restart it. I could uh, shell into it. I could, I could just do various things with it. Um, but you know maybe we want to clear it off the history or we want to get rid of it. So what I'm going to do is um, let's delete this container here. Um, so I'm just going to I'm just going to pull the ID right here, and I'm going to do Docker. RM, and then I'm gonna throw the ID in there. Let's relist, and I expect that to be gone. So this container here, um, this instance that we just ran very briefly, um, is now gone, and it can't be retrieved anymore. Um, so that, yeah, we just got rid of that container, even though it was already stopped. Um, now this container here, has been up and running for 10 minutes and it's still running. So it, I think if we try to delete it, we're gonna get an error. What we wanna do is we wanna stop it and then delete it. Um, and to stop a container is uh, docker stop and then the container ID. So let's go ahead and do that. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna copy this ID for this container, docker stop. And this is, this is a useful uh, command for uh, when you want to commit changes or change the image name or maybe do a migration or move things around. Um, so let's just do a Docker list again. And we can see here that's the container, but now it's exited because we stopped it. Um, let's go ahead and delete it. So Docker RM, same command as a bash command pass it the container ID, relist, and now we have nothing. Um, so those are just some basic um, container management commands. Um, definitely very useful.